Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays Rim World of Magic Royalty 1.2. Telling you. Got a lot going on. We got a lot more to get going on, too. We're going to replace this wall with something a little different. Probably just a wall made out of. Well, I don't know. I had this internal discussion with my brain about it the other day, but. I don't know if I still want to do brick fence, if I want to do, like, uh, maybe a reinforced wall. Who knows? Maybe I'll just replace it with nothing. That'll be great. Our new uh, weapon area is going up. That's also great. Let me tell you, man. We got a quest to accept, too. Prisoner in the Nami. I want to get this healer mech infinite reactors. And the uranium could be good, too. All right. She's apparently dropping in pods. There she's dropped, lads. All right, Nanami. There she is. Dark Shadow, you're literally right here. Can you go ahead and just stack her away into the prison? She's apparently quite smart and also a good cook. We have to keep her for six days, which we can definitely do. Demis, got more skills. Pay more bills. More pistol specialization for you, dude. All right, now I'm thinking I, uh, we discussed it a bit. And by we discuss it, I mean you commented a bit. And I generally agree. Our research area needs to be bigger. And wouldn't you know it? We got this area right here, and I think we can repurpose all of it. Because what do we got over here? We got uh, six beds, as you can see. One of which is held by a couple. So this is actually unowned. So if we put Zenith and Facilla over here... Please understand. Boom. Boom. It's a it's an upgrade as far as bedrooms go. From mediocre to slightly impressive. So that alone is good. But then we just take everything else out of here. Creo and Miranda can just move on over here. Because this area is decent. These are all better rooms. And we have uh, four of them available. So... That's two, and then we can... Do two more down here. Pepsi, Mama Reynolds, Shotaru. You all can move. The party's finished, by the way. It's pretty great. Uh, that's not where the Nami was supposed to go. Dark Shadow, what in the actual literal hell are you doing? You just kind of... Why? I mean, thankfully, you're sedated for a little while longer, but why did you do that? But yeah, we'll move all those over. We'll get these beds cleared out. Do we have one more bed available? Uh, it appears that we do not. None of these are available. No, they're not. Well, that's awkward. Uh, I guess we need to make one more bedroom somewhere. No, we could do. We could just build a place here on this river and change that. Hey, they enjoyed their stay. 100%. Sake. Antifreeze. Neat. Yarrow bandages. Demon hide. Wood. Ibuprofen. Thank you so much, lads. Much appreciated. But I could build another room down here. You know, all I gotta do is bridge up this area. Which we can totally do. Maybe not with these basic-ass bridges. With, like, some sandstone-ass bridges, you know? Or limestone-ass bridges. Some kind of ass bridge. Please understand. But, you know, you just do that. And then... You know, your house is slightly bridged up. But that's okay, because it's still gonna be pretty nice. And you just put the wooden bridge, like, right here to connect it. And then one of you gets to move in here. Need some... Wooden horizontal parkets over here. So let's go ahead and do that. Wooden. There we go. Wooden horizontal planks. Nah. Wooden horizontal parkets. Or parquets, if you prefer. So get all that built. That'll be good. Get that done. Get this deconstructed. And then we can just build wall here, wall here. Get them connected, and bada bing is bada bing is you got a much bigger research area that we can kit out with research items. Mainly the little, uh, these little shits right here, the research counters. They're worth a lot. 
because it's like 1%, but you can stack them 20 times. Anyway, the Nami's here now. Pretty great. We can cure that blood rot, can't we? Yeah, let's freaking cure the damn thing. 100% success chance, zero chance on fail, or zero chance of death on fail. Uh, excuse me, what was the price of that again? 10 Glitter World medicine? So it literally needs Glitter World, not even a quality of medicine. Ugh. I mean, we could afford it. So, actually, why do I even need to do that? Um, frickin' Fran. Frickin' Fran, where you at? Yo, frickin' Fran, before you go rest, come over here. Because you got skills, you got bill paying skills. Yo, I got more magic skills myself. More prodigy skill, please. Alright, we're just crawling over the mud moat real quick. And by real quick, I mean very slowly. Fran's over here getting some target practice in. Well done. Beautiful work. Yeah, no, this is nice. This is a very nice spot. Uh, Notver has sent over some silver. I appreciate her. Thank you. Alright, Fran. Cure disease. If you'll please. Blood rot? Not on my watch. Okay, maybe on my watch. Well, it did reduce it. <laughs> so that's good. Yeah, you, you can go now, Fran. Disease immunity. It's actually actively going down. So... That's good. I'm kind of surprised it didn't take it away, but... I guess Blood Rod is just its own thing. Disease knowledge. Nah, yeah, level 3, I should be able to get rid of it. Huh. Well, dang. Two. Wait. Come on, go away. Get here, you stinky blood rot! Also, uh... We can fuel these back up for now. Actually, no, we should replace these with something else. Yeah, just take them down. It's Gare Bear's 64th birthday. So, say congrats and happy birthday to our zombie friend. Uh, let's put in some ceiling lights over here. That makes most sense to me. I can put in one here... And then maybe one just over here somewhere. And then just... Conduit the thing all around. Which we should have done in the first place. So there you go. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Yeah, apparently this just refuses to get rid of it completely. But that's fine. That's fine. We'll live. Probably. Loving the little plasteel door. Dark Shadow doing some late night bridge building. Many thank my dude. And I just realized I don't need to actually build here and here because there's going to be wall there. I do need the bridge, but I don't need the I don't need the flooring to be covered where I'm building the wall. So that'll be good. That'll be fine. Hmm, lightning. How are we doing on deconstructing over here? Uh, Miranda's bed has been, or room has been expanded temporarily, but there's more work to be done. Zenith and Basilla are in their new room. It's pretty great. I assume they're enjoying it. We also have a uh, group of red tree bandits over here. 21 of them, to be exact. Oh, we have this area to be painted too, but that's not, this is really not even that big of a deal. It'll happen eventually, and it'll be good. So I'm not too... Not too busy concentrating on that area. Kitsune 2 is giving us more Kitsunes. It's pretty great. And it looks like our lad over here, Dark Shadow, is going to actually finish off this area, which is fantastic. What a dude. Also, let's put in some flooring just going down to here, because we can. Um... Yeah, we'll do something nice, like staggered stone tiles. Just something different. You know? Up to there. Surrounded by good old limestone slabbies. And by surrounded by, I mean with three of them around it. Nice little dimple cup. Apparently it's very beautiful. And that's really all it has going for it. 
So can you still fish here? It's too small. Well, then expand it like one would expand Dong. Okay. Yeah, yeah, they're not touching. They're not touching, dude. Take out this area. And I assume it will, once again, be too small. Yes, yes. But. Hi. Again, just like expanding Dong, we can now have this zone over here. And boom, they're both the perfect size. Hello, Agricultural Trader DS Solutions. How you doing? You made a great video game console at one time. It's actually a handheld, but I can call it a console anyway because words mean nothing. Yeah, feed a bull of stew to Earth and then go trade with the DS Solutions. How long are they going to be here? 16 hours? Yeah, we got time. Agricultural Trader could have some really good stuff. Nice blink, me. Very well done. The Nami's over here. He's like, man, it's dark and I'm hungry. This all sucks. My blood's rotten. But mainly it's dark and I'm hungry. Let's go ahead and reduce resistance. Obviously, we're not going to try to get him to join us because we need to send him back. Right, how's this Mitchell dude over here doing? He's doing all right. He's missing a leg, but who isn't in this day and age? Uh, we'll just reduce their resistance. Do some chatting with them. Yeah, I have you on recruit. I'll leave that. All right, I got some trading to do, so if you'll excuse me. Dude, what is with Mr. Tail over here? He's remote controlled, but his remote's broken. I guess. All right. You got ducks? That's pretty great. You got goats? That's also pretty great. And a beagle. Yeah, that's good, too. Uh, rock nut paste. Excuse you. <laughs> I didn't ask for any lewd crap. Don't want your rock nuts. Okay. You don't really have that much for me. You have a lot of money on you. Which could be great if we were to sell some things. Like, we have a lot of coffee. Apparently, that's worth a lot of money. So, we'll sell some coffee. We'll sell some tea leaves, too. There you go. There you go. Make some muns. Or you can have all the tobacco. I don't even know where we got it from. Probably a raider. Had... Pants full of tobacco. As you do. That's really all I want. I don't even want to sell you... I don't want to sell you boy. Why would I sell boy? Here, have some... Have some... Kittens. That'll work for you. We're keeping sassy and scrappy, though. Cool. Hey, we made money. Bought some hay. What's well, not the love? Alright. Get the hell out of here. I guess I could just move this drop spot, because it looks like they just can't land literally there. Oh, no, don't move. Wait, wait, wait. Um, build copy, because you can only have one. There you go. That'll work. That should work. And the next time a ship lands, it should land right there in the middle. I believe. Either way, I like this concept that we can now have ships ru rummaging around. Obviously, I can't send you to a settlement. The Nami Bong. Are you related to Susie? You are. You're the faction leader's granddaughter. That actually explains a lot why you're sent here as part of a scandal, quote unquote. Tamu? What's wrong with Tamu? Stop standing. Go eat. I'm telling you. These dudes. Hyena and Tamu talked about constructing batteries. It was pretty great. Everyone had a good time. Except the ones who were dead. I don't know how you died from constructing a battery, but that can be dangerous work, so I can see it happening. We continue to produce coal. Not exactly a, cl a clean fuel, but it, it works. Kind of. Yo, Vulpy. Dust devils. I don't care what you're doing right now. Stop it and give me a dirt devil. All right. If you can cast it, I want it cast. This is part of why I need robotics, man. Because they don't just cast the Dirt Devils anymore. They're supposed to be doing it automatically, but they don't. Therefore, you know... Robots will do what Nintendo. It'll be pretty great. Tim, what are you doing? Hauling in silver? I mean, that's pretty great. Uh, craftsmen are affected by a lack of supplies in Eretti. 
That doesn't mean much, because all they supply me with is power. Which we're still good on that. Yeah. Not a big deal, fortunately. What are you doing, Mr. Mask? Oh, you're working on your medicinal skill? It's pretty great. He's got it up to 13 from working on it. So it's obviously been working out. Space already occupied. Um, excuse me, I'm slightly confused. Black patrol? There's a patrol point stuck here? And it's occupying the space. Excuse me. I hate having to do this, but... This is just blowing my mind. Uh, destroy. There. Alright. That's why you don't permanently disable development mode. At least not when you're playing with mods. Okay, that's fixed. Get the rest of the place all shooped up. Someone will live here and they'll like it, probably. I mean, we got one limestone bridge section over here. That's where you put in the, um... Aqueduct. See? And you don't even notice. It's fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is gonna work out great. Everyone's gonna have a nice place to live. Everyone's gonna have pomegranates, apparently, judging from the outside around here. Although part of that is a psychic bloom. Yeah, everyone gets a mood buff. Rapidly spreading flowers will overgrow everything, including your fields. Well, I don't see them in our fields. So, I guess that's fine. At least not in our wheat fields, but it's grown over here. Look, you got a sunflower over here. It's perfectly mature. What's not to love? Right? It's, it's perfect. Dude, this went up so fast. What the hell? Alright, uh, paint. Grab this color. Paint the walls. Paint the door. And we'll be good. And we just need to put in a new bed section here. Do we not know how to make regular double beds? Oh my gosh, we've, we've forgotten so much. What kind of beds can we make? Um, I see bed rolls. And, well, we can make advanced beds, but we don't remember how to make regular double beds. God, I love video games. Anyway, <laughs> give me a wooden advanced bed here. Someone's getting a nice bed. And it ain't me. Someone's actually going to get a nice ass room over here. Maybe not an ass room, but a nice room. Yeah, let's see how that works out for you. It's an experimental room, please understand. Dex is here. Oh yeah, that's right, Sharkwalker moved over, uh... Moved over into this area, which is probably not going to be beat by this advanced room, although the advanced room will likely be... pretty nice. Although there are better beds you can make, and eventually we will probably make those, but this is going to be, uh... Okay, thank Frick. The only one that actually costs advanced components is the bed itself. Because we're not exactly swimming in those. We got 41, which is a fair amount, not gonna lie. But it's not a not a 10 out of 10 amount. Hey, you can see where the beds are, or the beds, the ceiling lights are. Fantastic. This entire room is now lit. Bam. Yeah, get rid of these as well. We'll replace those with ceiling lights too. It's only 15 power each. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful. Hey, what was that? Is that Mr. Mask over here? Punching? Doing some martial arts? Come on, guys. Zenith is over here cleaning up manually. Get these dust devils running. Come on, we got stuff... Other stuff to do. We can't be... What the heck was that? like some sparks or something over here. Did I... Am I going crazy? Have I lost the plot? I mean, that wouldn't be new, but, uh... Hmm. I guess, uh... I guess we'll have to live with whatever I saw there. 
What is up with Tail over here? You are from Terander, so we can't just, like, oof ya. But also, you're stuck. You want to go here. Really badly. But, uh... But you can't. And I don't think it's the wall that's in your way. I think you're in your own way. Yo, Frank over here getting stuff done. For some reason, clicking on the bed really slows things down. Not entirely sure what's causing it. I can just acknowledge it. Yeah, this section over here looks alright. Ooh, I really like this flooring. <laughs> Frank. Frank, my dude. You didn't have to make it that good. Not connected to power? There is no freaking way we don't have conduits somewhere over here. Or maybe there is. This- none of this room has conduits near it. Oh my sweet baby Jeebus. I am the dumbest man. Or just the laziest, I haven't decided yet. Uh, Gare Bear is in a work frenzy. So happy that it's his birthday. Look at him go! There you go, yeah, this lights up- these things light up the whole room. It's wonderful. They even partially light it up around here. I don't even know how that works. Oh, is it the is it the prison signs lighting it up? It might actually be the prison signs lighting these things up a little bit. Hey, Gare's father and grandfather. Oh no, from the Exodus Empire. Don't look at him. He's slightly dead. Hold up. He got a case of the oops. He got better, though, as you can see. He's doing alright. He, he has no skills to pay no bills, but... That's okay. He's still doing okay. Still rocking decent crafting and good melee. Alright, so now everything is fully lit in here, fam. So we'll be fine on that front. Pepe! Going after some chibi muffs, huh? I understand this, I do. Excuse you, uh... Paraceratherium. Definitely a great, fun name. Largest land mammal known to land. It's a gentle creature, apparently. As you can see. Yeah, well, that is definitely a big creature. Let's eat them. Uh, we'll see how they taste. There you go. Excellent quality bed. 142% Rest effectiveness. That's what I'm talking about. That's the ticket right there. You still got one more to go. Frank, you just... Gotta charge a portal? No, no, do this first. I understand your desire to charge the portal. I really do. But let's get that room done. Hey, Miranda brought Liberty back to the fold. Hi, Liberty! Ain't doing! Four years old? You having a good time, I hope? Well, that's a lot of dead bodies. And, of course, there's revenge. I mean, we kind of saw that coming. Alright, Dexa, let's try not to get yourself killed. Okay, run. So this is the Oh, fall down. There you go. Uh, this is not good. <laughs> Sigh! Get back! Okay, we could have thought this through a little bit more. Probably. Alright, come over here. Dexa, you come over here. Dexa, you undrafted yourself. Or I did it, one of the two. Uh, he's going back after you. Okay, no, no, this is good. This is good for Bitcoin. Let them come after you. Stop shooting that thing, please. Ooh, you can see all the bloodshot. Or all the bleeding points. Neat. Okay, we need you to step out of the shield, please. Okay, it's down. We're good. Good work, team. You done it. There you go, the room's done. Excellent. 56. 
Not bad. Not bad at all. I dare say it might even be good. That's a lot of blood in that room. That was quite a bit. Hey, give me... Give me some pomegranates. Just while we're here. While we're alive. Give me a little bit extra. And the conduits are done over here too. So this room is extremely lit. Bam. Yeah, it's nice. This is nice. So when are they dropping the mechanoids? It says they'll deploy nearby. Do you mean like... No. That means it's going to show up somewhere on the map, most likely. Which actually reminds me, we need more defenses. Probably just need more of these plasteel precision turrets. You know? Maybe move these guys over here on these corners. And move the precision ones to the bottom. I think that makes more sense to me. No, oh, Zinus, you're going to have so much work there if you're going to do that. Oh, boy. Oh, there's uranium. We don't have uranium. Uh, the other one is attacking. Okay. All right. Zinus. Shoot. And you have so many skills now. Um, I mean, we could try Animal Bond, but... Psionic Storm? What? He has the Mortar. Lifesteal. Legion. Throw a knife. Throw a knife. Throw it. There you go. Now give me... Bow Training? No. No. Could try to re to possess it. You have sniper training too? I don't even know if that's that kind of a skill. Either way, we took it down. Oh, it's up. Well, now it's up, but it's bleeding out. So, you know, it's not not technically danger. You can tell because the shield went down. Dismas over here like, oh, I guess we should knock this thing out now. Cool. Good job, Dismas. How'd you kill it? With a shot. Where'd you hit it? That's all I wanted to find out. Oh well. Uh, apparently... Oh, this is Dismas talking to himself. Apparently he was talking to himself about immortality. As you do. Alright, these rooms are coming down, baby. I'm probably going to replace these walls entirely. Which I think I got a mod for that. Replace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna do an actual full replacement. We're gonna replace them with sterile walls. I mean, you can make them different colors, but apparently that doesn't mean much. At least not to the test thing here. All right, give me some teal ass sterile walls. We're gonna replace them like this. And then we'll do the outsides. And then we'll do the spot in the middle. Which is mainly going to be just shutting that down. There you go. Start with that. We'll see how that goes for us. It's a good project, I think. Speaking of things that I think... I think it's time for Gare Bear's party. But also, I'm thinking we'll wait for this... This mechanoid cluster to hit. Before we go after the Desperado camp. We've got 24 days to take on the camp. So we want to have everyone prepared here, in the colony first, you know? At least that's what I'm thinking. I'm actually thinking now we just move these around a bit. We could have this slightly better off, so... Move the turrets into the center, then have them flanked by the... Move the precision turrets into the center and have them flanked by the other ones. Uh, apparently, Aretti is being attacked by the Varium Empire. Power is four. Aretti's power is seven. If suspectus, we should be fine us. And if we're not us, I'll be upset us. Probably us. <laughs> Probably a little bit. Maybe a little upsetting. Can we upgrade Aretti? Uh-oh. Oh, I thought it was attack time. 
Okay, Areti's in the process of being upgraded. Notver's now in the process. Neckwood's in the process. I think Swampwick and Treewick are already being upgraded. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so now all of our cities are in the process of being upgraded. It'll take a while. It's fine. It is what it, what it is, and in theory, that's all that it is. Could get another, uh, another quest here. Who's nearby to grab it? Brant, I guess. Brant, can you go ahead and talk with... Estosros? Estro... Estosros. Constance? Estosros. I think I got that right. What are you doing here, dude? What is going on? I mean, I guess... I could just leave this as is. If I wanted to be cheeky. Oh, no, I didn't want you to trade with him. That was my mistake. Although he does have an EMP shell for some reason. Which is interesting. Don't get it twisted. Uh, check the quest. Okay. That's not a lot of quest opportunity. Try again. Nope, nothing. Really? That's weird. That seems really weird. I'm just going to try and confirm it real quick. But that seemed weird. Hey, maybe that is how it is. And maybe that's all that it is. Either way, we're, we're, we're going to get our new research room eventually. You really walking all the way in here? To, yep, you are. I mean, I guess that makes sense. That is where you go to eat. Yeah, saloon doors are neat, but they do take a little bit longer than the auto doors. So we might switch those around again. Auto doors are just... Yeah, just crawl over the table. It's fine. No, that's good. Maybe I crawled under it instead. That'd be even gooder. Anyway, this is Thet. Playing some RimWorld of Magic Royalty 1.2 in the goodest way. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like. Yeah, feel free to subscribe for more because it'll keep coming and won't stop coming. Till next time, enjoy the party over here for Gare Bear's birthday. My name is Thet, and I'll see you in the next video. Like, subscribe, and all that good stuff, which I... I'm really bad at mentioning. Party's over. I'll see you later.